Tonight, we are learning more about the issues the interim Star County Auditor said he had while putting together an audit report. Boyd Carter was prepared to present his findings at Monday's Commissioner's Court meeting. He didn't get the chance. Channel 5's Ryan Nelson found out what the auditor had to say in the report. Channel 5 News obtained a copy of the interim auditor's report from Boyd Carter. Carter claims almost none of Star County's more than 90 funds were audit ready when he took office in early May. The deadline is the end of June. Carter states that the closing books were only 5 to 10 percent complete at the time of his appointment, and Star County Judge Eloy Vera is ultimately responsible for the county missing the deadline. Star County Judge Eloy Vera's name is mentioned in Carter's report seven times. I was shocked. Carter claims the office he took over had no up-to-date filing or accounting systems. He says these issues were reported to Judge Vera by independent auditors for more than a decade. The report reads in part, in spite of the reports to County Judge Vera urging him to remedy the lack of accountability in most of the county offices, limited if any efforts appear to have ever been made to remedy this critical situation, which resulted in last minute or untimely audit completions for the last 10 to 15 years and the apparent misappropriation of hundreds of thousands of dollars by previous employees of the Star County Tax Assessor's Office. When they have come in, they give us a clean bill of health. Judge Vera says the external auditor reports he received didn't carry bad news. We should have been made aware of some of the things that were happening. The auditor goes on to say, I will not just fill in blanks and create numbers in order to satisfy the county judge with an audit that is false, misleading, and therefore possibly criminal in nature. Judge Vera responded to this allegation directly. Never, you know. Believe me, you know, I'm judicial, and I know the consequences of breaking the law. I'm not, I'm not going to tell you I have a halo, but I make damn sure I don't break laws. I follow them. Veta tells Channel 5 News he and Carter spoke earlier this week. I think we cleared the air. A lot of it might have been just um, emotions or anything and, and people uh, trying to convince you of things. But I think both he and I discussed it, and, and I think we, we're we over it. We can work. We reached out to the Star County District Attorney for comment. While he declined an on-camera interview, he said the auditor's report speaks for itself. Vera says Carter couldn't present his report because it wasn't listed as an item on the agenda. He will be presented formally at the Star County Commissioner's Court meeting in early August. In the studio, Ryan Nelson, Channel 5 News at 10.